Like juggles, or a guy that does magic tricks. Piano I mean, man. There's no place like Venice Beach in the whole world. I've not been around the world, but I have bus. I have bus in Canada, which is 40 below, and it catch up. You know, 40 below. Yeah, I'm not gonna play music. Yeah, yeah, it's over. In Toronto, like they do it. I've yeah. never done it. Because because where I'm from is Thunder Bay, Ontario. Rock and roll. I have two famous friends. One is Neil Young. Neil Young is a Canadian. And uh, tie dye so tomorrow. One day this show later tonight. If you want. Black, black women Cadillac. We got a poster to work on. I'm tired from it. I'm hanging out at the bar. It's too late. Is that what you were doing, bartending? Is this your car? Say yes, it is. I said, well, this is an old Cadillac. This is an old Cadillac. I said, who are you? I said, I'm Neil Young. I said, what do you do at my high school? I said, I'm dating one of your cheerleaders. I call him tomorrow. I'm going way back. But it's cold, it's cold in below there. And then and I was sleeping in my car one day on Law Holland Drive. I said to a policeman, where can you play music? He said, on Venice Beach. I said, where is Venice Beach? He says, you just go south and you'll find Venice Beach. So when I found Venice Beach, I slept in my car for a couple of years, and I play out here every day on Venice Ocean Fairway. Yeah. Because you people, because there's lots of people everywhere. Play on, play on. <laughs> I did that in, in Manhattan Beach, and a guy gets out of his chair and he starts walking towards me. And the manager grabs me by my shirt and drags me off stage and says, hey, Peter, don't sing that song, please. And, you know, don't because you, you're gonna you're gonna cause a riot. No, no, I did that just to be Mick Jagger for a moment. Yeah, and, yeah. There's no word. It's just a song that you can, you can't music. You, you can be as rude and as smart or as stupid as you want to be. Music allows you to be everything and anything you want to be. I couldn't speak English growing up, so when I found the guitar and started playing music, and people would say that I would come up to the girls that were having skipping rope. And I said, can I play skipping rope with you? They said, yes, but you have to be in Enders forever. I go, sure, I don't know what that is, but I'll, I'll be in Enders forever. After 20 minutes, I said, well, when is it my turn? She's not going and the girl looked at me and said, Peter, I never get a turn. It's 21 plus. <laughs> yeah, so you know, the so the you want to be Enders forever. So I like the lady upset. who does the door is going to be there at midnight. So I want to play skipping rope with the girls. And so I go, I go to back, back home and I go, Mom, if you're walking around and you find a dictionary, please buy the dictionary. The Yoda hat. So I can look at it and say, end this forever. That's what I'm going to be. I mean, I know everyone there, but I'm not sure what I'm going to do. I do know they check it out. Okay. I can stuff it up. Yeah, Lodge Room's probably going to start at 7. Yeah, uh, the opening. Lodge Room. This is Grateful Dead. Neil Young opening. Yeah, it's at 7, probably. I love the Lodge Room. Yeah. That's where I think my brother needs to be. That's pretty dope. Yeah, I got the bars. I got the bars. Mitch Ryder and the Detroit Wheels. Better the bowling alley here by the second huge bowling alley. And the gold vine stones throw. So as I'm driving these rock stars are coming out. That bar gold line right there. Gold line right across, like right out in front of the lodge. And I go, what's the deal with you two guys? What's the deal? It's the Woodshell Bar. Like there's no dancing. Mob us. So I said, well, there's no dance. I dance. There's like a teeny escape store that they play all the time. But it's fun to hang out.